Welcome back to another episode of V's Views here on castnet.net. I'm your host, Fraser Rogers, alongside David Michel, the Director of Player Personnel and Corporate Sales for the Penticton V's. Bit of a holiday edition of the episode, but uh, still lots going on in the world of hockey for the V's, David. Let's start about one big thing right now, so Western Canada Cup, uh, an early bird ticket deadline coming up on the 31st for packages. It's a great opportunity, great stocking stuffer right now. Absolutely. We're, uh, you know, as a staff working very hard right now to sort of push over and fill the building and we've had a great response from our season ticket holders and, and now we're essentially looking for the same out of our community partners and corporate partners around town and you know many uh, this week have picked up two, four, eight, ten tickets for the event and uh, what a great way to recognize some you know staff members or uh, even good customers. Uh, nothing better than a couple Western Canada Cup tickets. And you say there is that early bird deadline. It's a great time to save, not sit on your hands and not procrastinate. That's right. December 31st is when the deadline uh, for the early bird pricing, which right now is 149 comes to an end on January 1st. It jumps to 179 So to put that in perspective, I mean, if we look at previous hosts, uh, Fort McMurray was 275 Estevan was 250 So, you know, even at 179 we feel like we're incredibly well-priced to provide a, a great week of family fun and entertainment and, and hopefully a, a week that the entire city of Penticton can be proud of and rally behind and, and have some fun away from the rink as well. And some people think, ah, you know, it's holidays, it's off in April. Well, you break it down, it's just around the corner, and why not get involved right now? Well, and that's one of the things we talked about. We looked at the, the board, and, you know, we had uh, 19 weeks to go to the Western Canada Cup, and, they're, well, you know, a couple weeks for Christmas and New Year's, and next thing you know, we're going to be inside of a, a couple of months here. So the planning is uh, fast and furious on our end, working with our, uh, our partners to make sure the players have uh, their hotel beds squared away and the transportation to get here. And, and I think that's one thing that a lot of people don't really understand is the scope of this event in the sense that the V's are responsible to, to have the players stay at the lakeside for the entire week and they got to feed them and they, they need to get here and, and that's all on, on the V's dime. So it's a big undertaking by our, our franchise and we're proud as, as heck to host it but uh, now we just need the community to sort of rally behind and, and help us sort of achieve those objectives to pay for it all. Big investment by the team now looking for that community investment as well. If people are still interested and obviously want to get their tickets before this deadline, how they do so? Uh, just call the V's office. Laura Carlton uh, can help out as well uh, online at uh, valleyfirsttex.com. Uh, box office is open right through until uh, New, Year's, uh, New Year's Eve. So plenty of time to, to get the early bird package. All right, David, one more subject. It is the holiday season. Two guys you're quite familiar with, Tyson Jost, Dante Fabro, uh, with Team Canada, the World Junior Hockey Tournament, which will be starting uh, over the weekend. How's exciting to see guys one year removed from this program and playing in this rink going to be on TSN and playing for a world championship? Well, it's obviously very exciting for our program. Uh, you know, Tyson and Dante have been such tremendous ambassadors, really, from the time they got here as 16-year-olds and, you know, their time in college with uh, North Dakota and Boston, respectively, has been, uh, uh, you know, a great showing for our program and, and you just kind of know that we probably couldn't pay for this kind of advertising for the next couple of weeks on TSN. Uh, they're tremendous ambassadors and they're going to do a great job and hopefully for everybody in Penticton they help make it a, a golden Christmas, not only for themselves, but uh, V's fans here as well. You're a big fan of the tournament, as am myself. Kind of surreal to kick back on your feet, sit there during Christmas time and see two V's out there leading Canada. Well, it's funny. I mean, you, you look back at Christmas and those are the memories that, uh, you know, if you're a hockey fan, you remember John Slaney scoring in Saskatoon and that great team they had in Red Deer that year. And, you know, so now to think that, uh, you know, obviously a couple of players that we're um, you know, very familiar with will uh, will be there to represent it and have that opportunity to create memories of their own and, and hopefully, uh, like I say, make it a golden Christmas for everyone. Want to make it a golden Christmas? Get some WCC tickets right now until December 31st and make sure you watch the World Juniors on TSN. For David Michaud, I'm Fraser Rogers. Happy holidays. This has been V's Views on Castanet.